We think of evolutionary events as being kind of standalone. If, for example, humans migrated out of Africa, that was lovely, got to the rest of the world, end of season. But actually, of course, that's not how it works. When something changes, it has a knock-on impact. So, uh, you know, if we start to evolve tool use, for example, that had a direct impact on humans, because we could benefit from that tool use, but it also had a direct impact on other species. For example, trees that were now cut down that would not previously have been able to be cut down. So there are follow-on impacts. In other words, evolution can spawn more evolution. If you think about the evolution of flight in birds, before birds could fly, there was no need for trees to have fruit that could be kind of spread in the canopy. As soon as they had flying birds that could spread it around, it made sense to evolve fruit that might be attractive to those birds high up in the canopy.